What is up guys? Today we're going to be watching the scariest videos I could find on the internet. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy. Now let's enjoy this scary video. The farmhouse near his grandmother's home. He says that yes. And sounds that you never want to hear. Unwelcome guests. Eh? This next clip was sent in to me by John Plymel. He says that he and his friend Alan were checking out an abandoned farmhouse near his grandmother's home in upstate New York. Uh -huh. As you can see, the house is isolated. It sits in the middle of nowhere Barry. on a barely traveled back road. The outside looks like something right out of a horror movie. And the inside is no better. Monster can? Oh, yeah. Bro, it stinks. It stinks. That's probably the decay of the wood and all the mold oh, and all that garbage, garbage there. Somebody's using that as an illegal dump site. Look at that TV. Come and on, that those TVs are. Whoa. The house is a death trap full of rot and mold. The upstairs floor is so rotten the two are afraid to even try to venture up the stairs. In the basement is piled with garbage. Mm. Yeah, well, that's that. crazy. That's the basement? Yeah, that's disgusting. What it's just piled with trash. But then people are gross. They hear something upstairs. Is that a microwave? I hear something upstairs. You're hearing that, right? Like random footsteps? Somebody was up there, they would fall through. You can see spit. Yo. That shit. I'm going through the bathroom. I'm. Bro! Oh, jeez, the screaming. You were trespassing, and they did not like that. Now it's interesting to note that one mad. of the boys mentions that the floor is so rotten that if someone were upstairs, it would fall right through. Because when I was watching the video, I noticed this. It would fall through. Uh. That's weird. One of the narrow, rotten holes in the floor, it almost looks like someone is staring down at them from above. Or maybe it's just an optical illusion. Either way, the boys did not return to investigate further. Bro! I'd go with that drone. See what's up there. Through the mill. On the YouTube channel The Haunted Side, oh. ghost hunters Patrick and Sean investigate the supposedly haunted Donovan Mill in Nevada. Still in this mill? clip, the Haunted Side team is using a Kinect SLS infrared camera to scan for potential ghosts. And then this happens. Oh. I'm not sure if it's old floorboards just kind of popping as I'm walking, but I, I, I've gotten that twice now. I don't really know. And I'm getting a lot of high pitch frequency interference in here. Whoa, what the f was that? What? I have no. F what the f? Okay, what did on. you hear? I don't know, dude. That's pretty I wild. I don't know. I don't know what that was. It's mapping somebody over there, dude. Is it? It's mapping somebody over there. Dude, dude it... I heard like a like a blood curdling girl scream. Like, like it sounded like it was in the distance, but I, th I, I don't even. Dude, I That's didn't pretty hear crazy. that. That was very, very Ooh. spooky. Whoa, what the? F Whoa, what the? F Next, they set up a camera to Seems film a fake. large room that is one of the oldest parts of the Donovan Mill. We leave the night vision camera recording in this room all night, and about 45 minutes after we leave, we catch something unbelievable. Why does it sound like something's running? Like a machine. Oh. That's interesting. Would 
what's really strange about this figure is that it appears to be moving in slow motion. Here's the same clip played three times in fast forward so you can get a better idea of what the movement would look like in real time. That's interesting. Later on, the guys use a weird little device called an ovalus, which supposedly allows ghosts to manipulate electromagnetic fields to produce words from an internal dictionary. But they get more than just a few random words. Use whatever energy you need. Before time. Before time? Why did say two, two words? words? Yeah, it's two whole words on there. Oh, Ooh, oh, that's crazy. Bro, that said it weird too. Yeah, it like dragged it, dragged it. Oh my god. Oh. What the? That, that chair is no, mad at him. That was not me. Dude, oh my god. Oh, I got chills. Oh, yeah. Dude, I got chills all the way up to <laughs> it Reminds me of one of those uh, cartoon that villains. That was not me, dude. What's unbelievable about this chair moving is if you watch my body and the table, they're both completely still up until when the chair hits the opposite side of the table. So there's no way that I would have accidentally nudged it or kicked it or anything like that because you would have seen both of those move. Did the haunted side crazy. catch a screaming ghost on camera? What do you think? Maybe. By the way, you can check out this entire video Seems as well kind as of fake, though. Sides other investigations over on their YouTube channel. The Lady in the Water. Over the last week, this next clip has gone viral in the country of Saudi Arabia, even appearing on the nightly news. Oh. So the story goes that the townspeople of Jazan, Saudi Arabia, begin to hear strange. <laughs> Listen to that echo, dude. Bro, close the top to it. Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen, Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim, Malik Yom Adin. Bismillah, Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim. Allah, Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim. Bismillah, Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim. Allah, 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 Ar Rahman, Ar Rahim. Whatever they're saying, they don't seem to like it. The townspeople called local authorities, but by the time they arrived, the screaming had stopped. They investigated, but there was absolutely no one inside the tank. It's crazy. So this is like a water tank? 300 feet down. Ah, oh, nah, bro. Abandoned mines, I ain't going to no mines. Frank and his team explore some crazy, out of the way caves and mines. In this video, his team member Gabe agrees to be lowered into a 550 foot deep mine shaft in Mexico. Now, if you're even slightly I think I've seen this video. or have a fear of heights, this alone Actually. is pure nightmare fuel. I'm going down a mine shaft right now. I'm going to be going down 600 feet. Bro, 600 feet yeah, underground. Yeah, it's scary, I'll admit that. <sighs> That's a little fast. Oh, man. And it gets even scarier when the rope gets tangled and Gabe is just left dangling halfway down. We're just, we're just sorting out some knots and, or like uh, twists in oh, the rope. Gonna fix? I don't want to sit here too long. My imagination will go crazy. <laughs> Well, let's just look around a little bit. It's just super scary. That's crazy, I dude. That's ter that's gonna be terrifying. Right about now. But the creepiness doesn't stop there. At around 300 feet down in the mine shaft, Gabe hears something. <gasps> let's grab some rocks to drop. What was that? What? Oh, what was that? First, it almost sounds like a quiet little voice says, Oh, then there's a bizarre hissing sound. 
Yeah, so... Hmm. That there? sounds... There has been rampant speculation in the YouTube comments as to what the strange sounds might be. Everything from animals and creatures to simple rope noise. But what do you think? You can check out the entire I don't sound like no rope noise to me. That sounds like a uh, the mine over on the YouTube channel Exploring Abandoned I can't Mines. I can't remember. The creatures what are they of the night. But like so in this video recorded in East Texas. It's a mythological thing that lives under the ground and it's like a rodent. Texas. The uploader claims that there are some strange sounds going on outside his home. Well, we were sitting around hanging out, <laughs> watching TV, and the cats were laying right here at my feet. Next thing you know, they get up and take off running, tails puffed out, so heard something they didn't like. Yeah, and sounds like it. Strange sounds. Heard a few bangs on the house, so they heard something that they, something they didn't like, so go outside and check it out. What's going on? You better be going outside armed. I know, I'd be going outside armed. With a flashlight. Dark. Didn't see a thing out here. Obviously, chilled by my flashlight. Uh, what was that? There's something over here. I see the trail. I see the trail going up there. What's that noise? This guy can't be from the country. You hear weird noises out at night? You go outside with the gun, flashlight, don't see nothing, you go back inside. Cause I hear something like that, I'm just staying inside. First, he dismisses the sounds as simply being the howls and yips of faraway coyotes. But then the sound gets closer and doesn't seem so much like coyotes anymore. That doesn't sound like a coyote to me. Go on, get inside, boy, before he comes and eats you. So did this guy capture the sound of strange beasts howling and screaming into the night? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? Ooh, you that's decide. spooky. Thanks for watching. What is up, guys? I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on Twitch and Twitter or Twitter. Um... Link in the description below. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. You have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.